sports in Michigan absolutely buzzing right now between the Wolverines winning it all. Of course, we know the Detroit Lions making history that first playoff win in 32 years. Getting your kids involved on in the celebration, it can be a little difficult for some, but this is the brand that's going to bring you the funnest way, the most fun way to do that. Joining us now to share the details, we've got future fans with here. It's Mike and Mike, Michael Gold and Mike Schroeder. Guys, thank you for being here today. Future fans, what is it? Yeah, future fans, football is a family experience, learning football in a box together. It's a storybook led and it's an advent calendar like experience where you get surprise boxes along the way okay. that help reinforce the things that you learn in the storybook. And then Mike, so they find find you guys online on social media and that's how yeah, you guys get hooked up? Futurefans.com and, and Amazon and, and Jordan, the product was inspired by my team making an unexpected run in the playoffs two years ago. First playoff win in 30 years, just like the Lions right now. My then five-year-old daughter into the pageantry of the game, but the second the game came on, she was out of there. Okay. So frustrated yeah. that my team was making this magical run, but not being able to share with it, share it with her. Yeah. We came up with a way to teach kids such they can experience that magical run together. And of course, you want to spend time together, but it is it's really hard to keep the attention span. You know, in your case of a five-year-old, or if it's your ten-year-old, or maybe even a teenager here, what did you bring uh, with us today to be able to to demonstrate to everybody at home watching? Yeah. So we have a storybook, as Michael mentioned. It's a guided experience, so eight sessions, 10 to 15 minutes each. Okay. And you read in the storybook about these campers at Camp Rallyhoo that are at football week. And they're like, hey, you can learn football via whiteboard and some binders, or okay. we can play fun, silly games. Fun, kids silly are, games. Kids are obviously like fun, silly games. One of the games they play and read about is circle toss. And so I'll okay. demonstrate it here. So okay. uh, in the product experience, you read about circle toss, and then you get to open up a box and play in it yourself. In a story form, or is it like just like the rules and demonstration? Story form. Cool. Okay, story so form. make it more interactive. Exactly. And so let me explain how this uh, game works. So okay. you stand in there. In the circle? Yep, in the circle. And you have four tries okay. to throw one beanbag into okay. the next hoop. Okay. Oh, so just like yep. so just, so just toss throw it, it in? Okay, so okay. you got it. So then you get to move to I'm that too hoop. Good at this, You're man. too good. Too good at this. And obviously you can space it out and make sure, it more sure. difficult, right? Yeah. And so when you get it in, you get another first try. Oh, okay. Okay. So then we'll go to the next so one. So we go to the next one. Okay. If you get it into the last hoop, you get six points. Okay. And you get to dance the scratchy bottom hop, which is a fun dance. What's that we the dance? What, how, so, do we, how do we do it? Oh, let's do it. So okay. it's scratchy. Mike and Mike. Yes. There you go. Scratchy, scratchy bottom, bottom, chicken wing. <laughs> scratchy bottom, chicken uh -huh. wing. From, from the bottom, bottom to, to the, the top. top. Now, now watch, watch those, those campers hop. <laughs> okay? That's fun. That's and fun. so, okay. obviously, like, this is just a fun game that kids like to play. Sure. It also emulates the exact rules of downs, right? Okay, sure. And Four football. tries yeah. to get to the next thing, get past the yellow line, get a first down. What happens when you do? You get four more tries. What happens okay. when you get to the end? You get six points and you get to dance. Okay. So we introduce it to kids in an easy, fun way for them to understand. And then the book connects that to football for them. And what's the feedback been from people who have, have played this sort of advent calendar of games for their for their uh, son or daughter? Yeah, since we launched in September, the feedback's been great. First, we've won six toy awards from okay. parenting organizations, so that gives us a lot of credibility. And what we've heard from consumers, one, it's a great way to spend family time together around a passion a lot of people have, which is football. Okay. And two, it helps really learn those rules, and that helps kids unlock an understanding, and then something that they can bond with their family about, whether they're cheering for the Lions in the playoffs or whatever your favorite team is. So for example, this is what, oh, it's kind of heavy. This is what they would get, you know, in the mail, correct? correct? Correct. So this obviously is future fans for football. Correct. Are there other future fans for different sports or other events? There are. Over the next two years, we aim to have all major sports. Soccer okay. will be next, and that'll come out this spring. Have you figured out, I mean, football might be just the most popular. Is that why I released that one first? We started with football because it's the most popular, and okay. it was also kind of the inspiration behind the brand. Okay. And for you guys, two years ago, right, is when you said this kind of first idea came to mind. Yeah. And how's business been today or, I guess, two years later? Yeah. yeah, so we launched in September. We've had a great first football season and okay. holiday season. A lot of kids got Future Fans football under the tree for Christmas, which we're really excited about and, and really happy about how we're going for the future. Yeah, I mean, I love the packaging. I love the games. You said what's next for you is br bringing in different sports, correct? Bringing in different sports, and we're starting to work with different leagues and teams. Uh, so we actually have a partnership with the Cincinnati Bengals, uh, whereby their players went into schools this past fall and read a shortened version of this book. 
okay. uh, with first graders, played the game, and did the dance. Sure. Uh, a little bit shorter the, than the, the broader the part. Scratch the scratchy chicken dance, the scratchy bottom chicken. hop. Yep. Yeah. So maybe it'll be on an NFL field at some point soon. Okay, really um, cool. Yeah. Well, before we let you guys go, you said online. Uh, what's the website again? Futurefans.com and also available on Amazon. And you okay. can follow us at Future Fans Sports on Instagram. And give or take, what's usually the price for this for the football fan here? Yeah, $59.99. Okay. Well, Mike and Mike, thank you both very much. If you guys are interested, you heard it from them, footballfan.com, correct? Futurefans.com. Futurefans.com, yeah. correct. Sorry about that. I got oh, confused good. with the football here. Thank you, gentlemen, both very much. Thank you so much.